Welcome to the Age of Conan Combat System Tutorial. Here, we will show you the basics of fighting and combat in Age of Conan. To begin with, we will show you how to move your character around. You can move your character with the standard WASD key setup. This moves you forward, backward, and turns you to either side. You can strafe with the Z and C keys. To move quickly to a particular side, simply double tap the key for the direction you wish to go. This can only be done in combat mode. To sprint, hold down the shift key. While you will move faster for a short period of time, sprinting will drain your stamina, so use it wisely. At the bottom of your screen, you will see three arrows. Attacks in Age of Conan are both directional and real-time, meaning that you have to choose the attack you want to do when you want to do it. For example, the overhead attack will attack straight on, while the other two will attack from the right and left. Some classes will gain more attack directions as they level up. To attack an enemy, you will need to have him in front of you and within range of your weapon. If you wish, you can activate auto-facing in the options menu. However, there is no auto-attack in Age of Conan. You will control the timing and direction of all melee attacks. Also note that attacks do damage to all enemies within range of your swing, not just the enemy you have targeted. The markings you see around each target are their shield indicators. These tell you where your enemy is focusing his defenses. NPCs and player characters will adjust their defenses in real time, so you will need to watch how they fight and react accordingly, striking unguarded areas for the best damage. You can press the control button to bring up your own shield icons and use control and the 1, 2 and 3 keys to adjust your defenses. Finally, we have the combo system. After completing your first quest, you will receive your first combo, which uses the broken ore you're carrying. To use it, simply click the button or press the hot key for that combo. Then follow the directions that light up. Low level combos may only require pressing one or two directions, while higher level combos may require three or more button presses to execute. You will gain more combo attacks as you level up. Most combos will only work with a few styles of weapons, so choosing the right weapon for any given situation is quite critical. All combo attacks will also drain your stamina, so wise management of your stamina will be crucial in a combat situation. Finally, when combat is over, you can exit combat mode by pressing the slash key or by clicking the toggle combat ability in your hotbar. Now we will cover the basics of magic in Age of Conan. You will see your spells broken down into two tabs, the Friendly tab and the Hostile tab. In the Friendly tab, you will find spells that can be used on yourself, your groupmates and other friendly targets. These spells include self-buffs that enhance your power or defense, summons that let you call up new pets or allies, and healing spells. Healing spells in Age of Conan require aiming as they heal in a cone in front of you rather than just picking a target and pressing a button. In the Hostile tab, you will find spells to smite your enemy, impair their functioning and otherwise harm them. For example, you will find spells that do area of effect damage based on the caster's position as well as single target spells that do damage or impair whichever target you aim it at. You will also find point-based area of effect spells. To use these, click the spell icon or press the associated hotkey. Then use the green targeting indicator to aim and cast your spell. Read each spell description carefully for clues about when and how to use it. Casting spells will also drain your mana bar, so know your limits and plan your battles carefully. Learning to use magic, combat and movement will be critical to surviving in Hyboria. We wish you good luck.